So we have a theorem uh, I mentioned in one of the lecture videos. If the game is a simple game, and if there's no veto player, well then, a core is empty. I don't know if you remember this. Uh, well, I mean, this is not a proof, but you know, it's you know, this is why we have the theorems because they sometimes make our lives easier. So if you have the theorem, you can just use it and say, actually, in this problem, we don't have any core uh, stable uh, payoff vector because the core is empty. How do I know it? I don't need to sort of prove it to say it because I have the theorem. Um, well, so you have to be able to read the theorem. What does it say? It says the game is simple. Well, what does that mean? Remember the definition of simple game? Uh, the worth function either takes the value one or zero. That's what it means, a simple game. So this is a simple game. Uh, no veto player. Huh, so what was the definition of no veto player? Anybody remembers? It's if you don't include them in the coalition, the coalition doesn't happen, right? Like the grand coalition doesn't happen. Or uh, the uh, payoff vector. So if let's, for example, if it's like 51 for one party and they don't participate, then uh, no coalition will form. Um, I mean, it's not like no coalition will form. It means the remaining people are not going to be able to uh, pass the majority and get a positive surplus. Uh, but I mean, I think, I think you're right. So the, this is the formal definition. Player I is a veto player if uh, V of N minus I is uh, zero. All right, so if this is the case, I mean, I'm sorry. Uh, if I is a veto player, uh, well, then this is true. If this is true, then I is a veto player. Definitions are if and only if, don't forget that. So what does that mean? That means if I basically take player I out of this picture, uh, the remaining guys, therefore, will never be able to form a coalition uh, and um, sort of pass the majority uh, in this uh, game. So is there any such player in this game? Uh, I mean, think of... Uh, here, players are pol political party A, B, C, remember? So is political party A a veto player? Um, well, no, not really. If you think of the... Um, I'm sorry, I shouldn't uh, denote this one. The grand coalition, right? This is A, B, C. Um, so if you subtract A from this coalition, what are you going to get? You're going to get coalition of B, C. Well, B, C will still pass the majority. And hence, V of B, C is going to be 1. Uh, same for a B, same for C. I mean, uh, remember all the players, I'm sorry, all the um, two-player coalitions in this game uh, can pass the majority. And hence, uh, no player is a veto player. No veto player. Um, consider this example. A, political party A, B, C. Uh, maybe I need D, okay? Um, so think of this. Well, I think that's obvious, but, but who cares? Let's go with the obvious one. So 25, 20, 75, 10, um, 85, 15, okay? So for example, do we have a veto player in this environment? Yes. Who is this political party A, right? If you subtract political party A, what is the uh, worth of political party B, C, and D? Well, remember the total seats they have is 20, 30, uh, 45, less than majority 51. So therefore the worth is zero. So political party A is a key player uh, in a sense, okay? So if it vetoes, well, you can never pass any uh, proposal. So you have to have party A in your coalition if you want to uh, approve some proposal. All right. So therefore, in those games, remember this theorem has a second part. It says, well, in those games, simple games, the veto players are going to get a positive surplus and everybody else will get zero surplus. So in this game, for example, that theorem, thanks to us, says that Player one should get, I'm sorry, player A should get one and all the others should get zero. And it makes sense, right? I mean, political party A actually has the majority. And so 
uh, well, I mean, they should form their own government. They, they don't need any coalition. Uh, well, I mean, here, this is not a government forming example, but you got the idea. Here, however, no party has a power, that power. They need, all right, any party has a need to sort of form a co um, coalition. So no player has a veto power. And so therefore core is empty because it's a simple game. All right.